Hello everyone, Shaman Sini here, and today we're, I am demonstrating the ls command. I'm starting a new playlist or new series, and uh, with the goal of every couple days, I'll be posting a new video about a, a different command on a Linux system, um, with Debian being the demo system I'm using. And uh, the commands that you'll learn uh, will be able to be used on almost all Linux systems. Okay, so today we're demonstrating the ls command. So, um, the ls command is the equivalent of dir in Windows. Um, it pretty much li it's uh, literally called list. And um, what we can do is list the files and directories in uh, our system to find uh, where or find what files are in a specific directory. Um, so, every command that, that we'll learn. I definitely encourage you to look at the manual for it. So man ls. And because I'm not going to go through every single one of the switches, but um, I definitely do encourage you to take some time to look at each one of these switches, the command line switches, to see what each one does. Okay. Okay. And um, these is, this is actually right from the creator. And so all the information that you need is here. Okay. All right, so um, when you type in ls, just ls with no switches, you'll find the folders that are in, uh, are in the particular directory you're in at this time. Now, it does not show uh, hidden folders. If you want to see hidden folders, you can do ls-a. And now you'll see the hidden folders. Okay, anything in a Linux system that has a dot before the um, anything that has a dot before the file name is usually either a hidden file or folder. Okay, now if you wanted to see this in a list, like instead of uh, display like this, have a list and see the permissions, you can do ls la. Okay, and you'll be able to see the directories and files in this. Uh, folder. Now, to determine if this is a folder or a file, you can look here. Um, under the permissions, you'll see a D for which stands for directory. Okay, um, and in this case, this is the only directory in this uh, in the directory I'm in right now. This is the only folder. Okay, these are our files, and to know that, you can do um, nano, which is another command we'll learn later nano dot profile and you'll see that this is a a file it's not a folder okay now if you wanted to see let's say what the contents of this folder is you can do ls my folder and you'll see that there's a file in there called test and you can also do the same ls dash la and you'll see the same format. So you can do this with any directory in the operating system. So ls say the root directory, ls slash home. Okay, you'll be able to see there's different, there's definitely different type, uh, different ways of navigating the operating system with this command. It's a very useful command and you'll probably use it a lot on your day to day. Um, day-to-day -day administration of a Linux system. So I hope that this helped you uh, get a grasp of the list command. Uh, I plan on doing these videos along with all my regular videos. And if you have any questions or comments, leave them in the comment section below. You can also visit my website, shamancini.com. And you can also email me if you have any questions, shamancini2010 at gmail.com. Speak with you all soon. Thank you.